Okay, hey guys, this is I'm on Metro Fishing, and I'm going to be doing a Tackle Warehouse unboxing. Just came in today, and this will be part one of part two, because my friend got one too. So, first off, we got uh, just plain tackle warehouse t shirt. Comes if you spend a certain amount. So, let's put that to the side. And next, we have a uh, Booyah Shirtus and Ball Blade Spinner Bait through the sounds. Next, we have a uh, Booyah, same thing through the sounds, but in. Uh, white and uh, basically a bleeding shad. And also, uh, Dr. Comanche Classic Spinner Bait in Shotu Silver. This is usually like a 10 or 12 dollar spinner bait, but it's on sale. And I picked it up because I've seen them on a couple different websites. And supposedly they're pretty good. And next we have a Lake Flood Live Magic Shad in uh so it doesn't even say what color it is. It's like a silver it's kind of just basic a shad color. So yeah. And then next we have uh two swim jigs. It's an alternate tackle swim jig, one in a black and blue and one in a bleeding shad again. I didn't spend too much on the swim jigs, just basic flow box because I don't know how it's going to be for this, but I've just seen a couple people swim jig and it looked kind of fun. These are the trailers for them. One is in just shad and one is in sexy shad. Well, actually this one's bleeding shad. So yeah. And then next, moving on to more jigs, we have um, some bitsy flips. Strike King. One, I'll set it off, is in a green pumpkin. I only got one in green pumpkin because those don't seem to produce that much. It's mainly just black and blue. And I think, I don't see it. We got one, three, it sounds black and blue. Two, same thing, same exact thing. Another, same exact thing. Um, another, same exact thing, I believe. Yeah. And then, this is another, same exact thing. Bitsy flip. Uh, I was really running low on those because I had a couple lost them and stuff like that. Those, the smaller jigs seem to do better than another bitsy flip, black and blue. So, yeah, and I have three more of these coming in back order. But that's one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I got ten total, so, unless there's another one in the box. Well, next, I guess we'll just move on to. Some Senko stuff. Next, we have six pack of all new wacky hooks. These are pretty much all I use for wacky hooks. You can use them for drop shots to strong hooks. Usually, not, if you hook a fish, it's usually not coming off. And we have one, five of these, and one knot, and one and two knot because. Uh, one knots seem to be a good size. Two knots can get too big sometimes, and they can feel the hook. You see it. And you see, see that senko. And he was the last one, so that was six packs of those, I believe. Yeah. Then to move on with the, uh, actually, skip going with the senkos, but with the bitsy flips. Um, I'll show you what I got for those. It's just. I have Strike King Ridge Chunks back loaded black and blue flakes, but those didn't come. But got Net Bait Pack a Chunk in black sapphire. It's kind of like a bluish black. All the colors have got bluish black. And a black blue flake. Net Bait Pack a Chunk. Same thing. Another Net Bait, uh, Net Bait Pack a Chunk in black and blue. Another Net Bait Pack a Chunk in black blue flake. Uh, black blue shadow net bait pack a chunk and another net bait black blue flake pack a chunk 
Mainly I just got these in the Stoic King League chunks because those seem to do best with the bitsy flips like I showed you. And uh, I haven't really tried many other jigs because these just seem to produce good. And moving on, still with net bait. I have a medley packet chunk in black and blue. Another one in black and blue. Another one in black and blue. And one more in black blue shadow. So that's ten packs of net bait packet chunks with two Strike King Ridge chunks that are backloaded. I don't know if I'll make another segment with those. You guys can comment if you really want to see. It's just a couple of cling baits, uh, some more soft plastics, and more of these. Then I'll move on. This is basically the majority of my order. Um, yum dingers. These, I guess last year we didn't really get into deep water fishing, but if you like shallow fishing, the Yum Ding, 4 inch, 5 inch, doesn't really matter, with the only wacky hooks. I'd say that was the best combo we used. I mean, big fish, small fish, any size fish will take it, but we do catch it. It's worth the quantity. You don't catch as much quality bass, but you they will bite it too. Like We caught a couple 5 pounders on these, and that's good for Minnesota. But, uh, net bait, black blue, twist and 4 inch. I, I don't know if I got accidentally did 4 inch but I meant to get 5 inch. Another 4 inch in black blue. And then another pack of 4 inch in black and blue twist. So that's 3 packs in black and blue. And then next, still yum, we have a 5 inch Marigua. Um, 5 inch melon pie. Yum ding. Five inch watermelon seed. This is one of the best colors that is in black and blue. And a black blue flake, five inch yum ding. Still yum, we got a June bug, five inch yum ding. Uh, another June bug, five inch yum ding. Uh, another muddy glass, five inch yum ding. Then we have a watermelon uh, white laminate, five inch yum ding. Uh, black with blue laminate, five inch yum ding. And then a uh, watermelon white laminate, yum ding, five inch, and a watermelon candy, five inch yum ding. And then we have a five inch black and blue laminate, yum ding. A watermelon seed, yum ding. 5 inch, a black blue laminate, 5 inch yum ding, and a watermelon candy, 5 inch yum ding. And that is it, but I'll just give you another quick recap of what I got. Um, so we have a live magic shad, AT, swim jig, swim jig, I mean swim bait, swim jig, swim jig. Spinner bait, spinner bait, spinner bait. Uh, ten packs of net bait packet chunks, black blue, all of them, but some strike king ledge class back loaded along with clearing baits. Six pack of only wacky hooks, six packs. Um, seven bitsy flips with a couple more back loaded. Tackle warehouse t shirt and twenty packs of yum dings. So yeah, that's it. Um, comment if you want to see the uh, segment of the, my backloading stuff. It's only a couple minutes worth, but yeah. Bye.